Ilhan Omar, D. Minnesota, said at a press conference on Wednesday at the Capitol to announce a House bill that would prevent a president from determining whether people who may pose a national security threat can enter the country that, although President Donald Trump hasn't built a wall on the southern border, he has created an invisible wall to keep Muslims out of the United States. Trump may not have gotten his border wall, but he's created an invisible wall keeping out people around the world based solely on their religion," Omar said at an event to gain support for the National Origin-Based Anti-Discrimination for Non-Immigrants Act or the No-Ban Act. I have said this before, and let me say it again," Omar said. I believe this ban will go down in history as a moral stain on our country's history. Omar said Trump used the travel ban to create a religious test for entry into the United States. In fact, the executive orders Trump issued, including the latest in March of 2017, only apply to six Muslim-majority countries with ties to terrorism as determined by the U. S. State Department, Iran, Yemen, Somalia, Sudan, Libya, and Syria. The order states. Executive Order 13769 did not provide a basis for discriminating for or against members of any particular religion. While that order allowed for prioritization of refugee claims from members of persecuted religious minority groups, that priority applied to refugees from every nation including those in which Islam is a minority religion, and it applied to minority sects within a religion. That order was not motivated by animus toward any religion, but was instead intended to protect the ability of religious minorities, whoever they are and wherever they reside, to avail themselves of the Usrup in light of their particular challenges and circumstances. The order also states that waivers can be issued for individuals from those six countries on a case-by-case -case basis.